It was freaking crazy. The cops were doing a full-scale siege next door. More traffic than rush hour. I mean, bleeding bastards running back and forth, Ronnie and Jimbo to throw. And in the middle of all this, there we were. I didn't give a damn. Just going with the flow. So what happened? Nothing happened. We got the explosives, dumped the cargo. We were home free. Jeez. A winter storm warning is in effect in the whole tri-state area as both freezing rain and heavy snowfall continue. Many roadways are already closed and people are advised to stay indoors. The severe blizzard has ravaged New York for three days now with no end in sight. We'd been snowed from the start in the Valkyr case. The forecast said there was plenty more where that had come from. But the snowbound city was on my side. Less chance of innocent bystanders getting caught in the crossfire.
Exhibit number one, a newspaper. Take vampire movies. Why are they always set in L.A. or Mexico? They can't even get a tan. If I was a bloodsucker, I'd move to the North Pole. Went this one long night. Yeah, and what would you eat? Suck blood from penguins? Nah, Eskimos, man, Eskimos. Whack! dead man tied to a chair lay on the boiler room floor. Captain Baseball Bat Boy has an unbeatable track record in superhero death matches. <laughs> but a six pack of root beer gets me every time. The murder weapon was a baseball bat, now lying in a pool of drying blood next to a newspaper folded open on a Captain Baseball Bat Boy comic strip. Chill with the guns. Trust me, you don't want to piss me where they are. Gentlemen, let's do business. Green for green. Tears of green-eyed angels. Amen. <laughs> 